Welcome to the video guys and like the title says Warframe has just released a free to play cross play and cross progression to PC and console. This means you can play with console and PC players on mobile and if you have an account on console and PC you can use that account. Warframe has been on console and PC for over 10 years now so you can only imagine how much content and how much cool skins this game has over this time. Well, that's also a bad thing as well because this game is over 10 gigabytes to download on mobile. Which, it's understandable because of how much gameplay this game has because it's also a story mode game that you can play with your friends. So, it's understandable, but that is a lot for the average mobile players. Warframe is basically a story mode game where you are a alien robot. Well, I'm gonna be honest, they have some insane skins. I'll put some up on the screen right here. Man, they are beautiful. The goal of this game is to destroy planets and worlds, and while you do that, you're going to be collecting loot to get better armor, better weapons, and you can use guns, you can use swords, all different types of magic weapons, it's crazy. And as you can see from the gameplay right here, this is just one of the heroes, and this game has a lot of movement. It's actually unbelievable how much of a movement game this is for a story mode game. This also is a bad thing as well because it can cause frame drops for some devices, but if you're frame dropping, I would recommend changing your settings, lowering it, and here's some advice for your settings. Do not use motion blur in your settings. It's very bad for this game. Also, here's some settings tips. I'll put some screenshots on the screen right here. Try this out if your game is framing too bad, It's because it's very possible. And because of these framing issues, they decided to go ahead and launch the global iOS version while they finished making the Android version. It's almost done. It's coming soon, but... They decided to go ahead and release it instead of waiting. Even though this is a story mode game, you cannot go mission for mission without thinking about what you're doing. You have to collect the right loot and craft the right gear. And because this is a story mode game, you would think it's pay to win, but it's actually not. You do not have to spend a single penny on this game to be able to defeat it. This game is meant to be free to play in every single aspect, which is one of the things I love most because this game could have easily made it pay to win and they chose not to. So mad respects to the team for doing that. Also, here's my username right here on the screen. You can add me. I'll be adding everyone back while I grind this game. So let me know what you guys think down below in the comments. What do you guys think about this game? Are you going to give it a try? And let me know how it goes. And as always, guys, I'll see you in the next one. Peace.